Hey guys, Justine here. As you can see, my life is in boxes and is a little bit chaotic right now. However, there is some exciting news. If you haven't heard this, I don't know where you've been, but exciting, exciting news. So in less than a month from now, I will be headed to Montreal. So I have a really great opportunity and as you know, or may not know, you should know. Uh, I released my first album, Shine, my first ind independent album. In September, we had a nice CD release party. It was great. And now the time has come for me to expand and spread my wings and fly, if you will. So I've booked my first music showcase. And what this entails for this preliminary round is 400 people and, of course, a panel of judges who are from record companies, Sony, Universal, you name it, A&R, um, you, you basically get, you know, producers and managers and all the people that you want to be in touch with and network with. They are there critiquing your live performance and basically seeing if they want to work with you, work with me. So, the th it's just so great. And the, th the greatest thing about this is exposure to new people and I, I just am so excited that I get to go perform for new people in Montreal and also you know it's all about distribution as well and that's what the main prizes are for this is just more distribution of what you already have which is awesome for me because I just finished my album so this is what I need from you uh, once again I am calling out for your help because I have to sell a minimum of 35 tickets to this event. Now, it would be a, a lot easier if I lived in Montreal and I can get my friends and family to come out. However, um, you know, I don't really know that many people there right now. So, this is the deal. They told me that I don't need the physical tickets because physical tickets are only needed if you're going to the show in Montreal. So, for the people that live in Sudbury or if you live anywhere in the world, if you would like to purchase a ticket to support my showcase and to kind of show them that I am supported as an artist because that's really why they have a minimum of 35 tickets is because they want to make sure that you have some backing behind you and the people that sell the most tickets kind of get a bit of an advantage and get to choose their set times and stuff like that. So if you want to purchase a $13 ticket you can do so just by sending it to me and you're just gonna have to trust me and rest assured that all the money does go to them the first day that I land in Montreal on the 21st and that's when I have my meeting with them I give them the money for all the tickets and then they give me a secret link so I'm creating basically a database a list of people who are buying tickets uh, they're paperless tickets I guess you could say so if you send me thirteen dollars whether it's cash or e-check whatever people have been doing both either way I'm gonna give them all the money and you will get a secret link to watch my performance live on the 22nd of November which is super super cool and I'm really pumped that you can see it even if you're not in Montreal I think that's really awesome so thank you so much to everyone who has bought a ticket so far and who has shown their support I think it's just unreal so thank you very much I have nine left to go so that's awesome and I think it's kind of unreal that some people have bought more than one ticket as well. Like, it's just, it's crazy to me. So, thank you so much. Uh, I'm very, very excited for this next leg of my career. And, you know, I just know that things are really going to start taking off from here. So, from my chaos of boxes and my life being kind of cleared out... <laughs> Uh, you know, I hope this finds you well, and I hope that I can sell the last nine tickets, uh, soon, because I'm heading out in three weeks. So, take care, thank you so much for the support, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.